Hey guys, welcome back to Homestead Prepping and Survival. Well, I got about half the grass cut. All this on this side of the house where I park and all of the backyard. Got to do that back corner and fruit orchard, but all the back. A little bit of the front, I didn't do much of it. I got to do it all at one time. But I threw some bread that was getting old out here to the chickens and I had some stuff I'd made and froze. And Want to empty the container, so I threw it out here. And tell you what, they knocked a dent in that bread. It was over half a loaf. I just don't eat it that fast. But either way, it's later in the evening. So hen still has not laid an egg since I put her over here. So she's going to stay. And I think I'm going to grab this other red hen and put over there. The little black tip brown hen is still on the nest setting. Five eggs still. I'm only getting, <coughs> excuse me, one egg a day. This white hen is pretty obviously molting and has not laid in over a week. The red hens, neither one, have laid in about that same time, pretty close to a week. So, little well, brown hen there is the only one laying because the other brown hen setting. So, disappointing when you're trying to hatch eggs and then all of a sudden they all decide they want to stop laying. But, as you see, some of the babies, if I can get the focus, are getting up on the roost at night. I'm hoping they'll all learn. They're getting pretty good size to them. They're about the same size as the little mama hen there. Most of them. There's one or two still smaller. But either way, just thought I would give y'all an update. And I've already uploaded a video for Monday morning. So this is Sunday evening. So just thought I'd show y'all. Since they are all inside the pen, I'm going to go ahead and close them up. Let them stay in for the rest of the night. I was hoping they'd all start getting on that roost, but anyway. I've been checking on eggs twice a day trying to hope I would start getting some from these hens that aren't laying but so right now I got one hen out of nine that are because them teenagers are old enough to start they just haven't yet so got one hen but you know I make do I'm sure they'll be back to laying more by the time I run out of eggs in the house. So at least I'm hoping they will be. I haven't had to buy eggs in a very long time. So <laughs> we shall see. But guys, I hope you've enjoyed your weekend and the beginning of the week. I've got some chores done today. I'm going to have to finish the grass after work in the evenings and i actually made it to the shop after church today and got the rest of my stuff out of the office because i haven't been in the office for a month and i just haven't had time to really go by there and get all my stuff out of the office so i did that and got it home got it taken care of because anyway i'm gonna tell y'all He's a sweet dog, but he is not the brightest light in the box. Yeah. His, his box of rocks might, might be a, a few short. But, <laughs> but either way, getting dark as y'all can tell. Should be able to in the camera anyway. Sky view. It looks darker on the camera to me than it actually is, but anyway. Hope y'all have had a good one. 
remember there's always a lull before the storm as they say or a calm before the storm it's still coming there's nothing anybody can do to fix it they could put trump back in there and he can't turn around this entire world what's going to hell in the handbasket as the old folks say so we got a long ways to go we started a new men's group at church and we met saturday morning did a breakfast and then a little conversation and bible study after breakfast so i really enjoyed that it's the first time i've actually participated in something like that and uh it was fun we did cook for a lot we had i think 23 guys there young men and middle-aged and older guys too so it was fun i'm looking forward to it i sure wish he would cut the grass for me sometimes it's a chore <laughs> anyway guys y'all remember what i always tell you jesus loves you and so do i y'all be safe be prepared